If you're a hardcore basketball fan, then you already know who Carl Anthony Towns is. But this isn't another basketball video. Today, we'll take a deep dive into the player's net worth, what he spends his millions on, and more. Carl Anthony Towns was born on November 15, 1995 in Edison, New Jersey. His parents are Jacqueline Cruz and Carl Towns Sr. He's the second of three children in a Dominican African American family. Carl's family has a middle class background. As we just mentioned, their origin has DNA of both African and Dominican roots. The Townsend Center grew up in Piscataway, New Jersey, where he was raised with his sisters Lachelle and Malachi Singleton Towns. Growing up in New Jersey, Carl found a passion for the game of basketball as he observed his father coach a basketball team. Carl's love for the sport was huge, and he often had thoughts about the magic behind how athletes could jump so high in the air with the ball. Towns was sure that the answer to his question could only be found if he ventured into the game. For this reason, he began his journey to basketball. Due to family tradition, getting a high school degree was mandatory. Growing up, Carl's parents transferred him to different schools. First, he went to Lake Nelson's Seventh-day Adventist School, after which he was rolled to go to the Our Lady of Fatima School. Carl later switched to Theodore Shore Middle School, where he repeated the seventh grade to improve his academic attributes. During the fifth grade, the young athlete always joined the basketball training of the technical high school, where his father coached basketball. After he graduated high school, Towns played for one season at the University of Kentucky. But once the 2015 NBA draft came around, he was selected by the Minnesota Timberwolves as the first overall pick in the 2015 draft. Today, he's one of the most solid players in the league, but as he continues to grow in fame, people tend to wonder about his personal life. Carl used to be in a relationship with Kwane Andrade in 2016. Kwane and Carl dated each other for two years and later split up in 2018. The main reason behind the breakup between the two is unknown. Towns is currently in a relationship with Jordan Woods. Towns and Woods met each other for the first time with the help of a mutual friend. After sharing contact information, Jordan and Carl started dating and celebrated their second anniversary in May of 2022. Similarly, the couple shares each other's pictures through their social media and are pretty committed to each other. So hopefully in the near future, we'll see them tying the knot. In his spare time, Towns enjoys traveling and making memories. In 2020, he was vacationing on a yacht in Cabo San Lucas, Mexico. Carl took his girlfriend on a tropical vacation in 2021 to commemorate their one-year relationship. Similarly, in 2022, he lavished his girlfriend with diamonds and a new Chanel outfit as a surprise retreat to enjoy their second anniversary. They uploaded a video from the romantic weekend getaway at San Cedro Ranch in Santa Barbara, California. NBA stars have to go fancy when it comes to vehicles. Carl Anthony Towns drives a Mercedes Maybach. The car cost around $186,000. So why did Carl pick the Maybach? Easy, he's a speed lover. When Carl first entered the league, despite being the number one overall pick, he was scared to spend his newfound fortune. One time on the Courage and Nate Shot show, the basketball player said this, when I first got to Minnesota, which is possibly one of the coldest tundras of all time, I didn't even get a car. I used to walk to the games. I would go get 25 points and I'm walking right back with everyone like, all right guys, I'm gonna go back to the house now. And what a house, right? The Minnesota 7-foot center lives in a stunning home in Medina. To purchase this real estate, Towns had to shell out $4.5 million. The estate features 17,251 square feet. The massive property comes with 5 bedrooms, 9 bathrooms, indoor and outdoor pools, a golf hole, a tennis court with a tea house, a hot tub, and other features. Property taxes were $67,000 in 2018. But with his new contract, he should be in Minnesota for a while. Spending his downtime chilling in this ridiculous, lavish mansion has to be a good life. But after seeing how he lives, many tend to wonder, how much money does the NBA star actually have? As of 2022, Carl Anthony Towns' net worth is around $9 million. The Minnesota Timberwolves used their number one pick to select Towns in the 2015 draft. So far, he's fit in as a foundational player, but is yet to enjoy any playoff success. Towns has lived up to his expectations as an individual player in the NBA, and his numbers serve as evidence. 
The towering center averaged 18.3 points and 10 and a half rebounds, as well as shooting 54.2% from the field in his rookie year, which earned him the 2016 Rookie of the Year Award. From 2015 to 2019, his rookie deal was four years and at $25 million, so an average of about $6.25 million per year. Towns has only played for the Timberwolves in his career so far, and all of his salaries have come from the Wolves. The Wolves tied up Towns on a massive extension in 2018. He inked a five-year $190 million extension, which makes him an unrestricted free agent in 2024. Towns' salary for the 21-22 season will be about $31 million. Quite a raise to say the least, but if you got it, flaunt it. But the player just doesn't depend on contract money to boost his net worth. He also endorses several brands to create various sources of income. According to Forbes, Carl Anthony Towns has made at least $3 million from his endorsement deals with numerous reputable brands. As a basketball player, Towns gets offers from shoe brands and numerous fashion lines to promote their products. Towns is a Nike athlete, but has yet to receive his signature shoe. The Townsend Center had been sporting Hyperdunks previously, but was recently seen sporting the Nike Air Zoom BBNXT on the court. Carl Anthony Towns has made deals with 2K Sports, Nike, Beats Electronics, Gatorade, Panini, Secret Lab, T-Mobile, and YouTube. However, despite all these endorsement deals, the athlete goes out of his way to give back to those in need. Towns has made several charitable donations on his behalf and continues to give back to society. Back in 2016, he donated a Kia Sorento, the prize for his Rookie of the Year award, to the Minnesota Leukemia and Lymphoma Society. He also did a heartwarming gesture during Thanksgiving 2017 as the Wolves Center donated $10,000 to the House of Charity Ford Center in Minneapolis. Town's mother passed away due to complications with health during the pandemic outbreak. Furthermore, Towns made a sizable $100,000 donation to the Mayo Clinic in the wake of the pandemic crisis in March of 2020. Carl was named Gatorade National Player of the Year after calling the attention of town evaluators during his senior year at St. Joseph High School in Metuchen, the skilled center was recognized as the Gatorade National Player of the Year at a Hollywood Awards ceremony in July. Carl used a speech to thank his mother, who he said cooked him countless delicious meals to feed his giant-sized body, and his father, Carl Town Sr., who worked four jobs to take care of them and spent his earning on a basketball court in their backyard so he could practice. Towns was ranked number four among the best recruits in the U.S. He had a season for the ages in his last year at St. Joseph's, accumulating 20.9 points, 13.4 rebounds, and 6.2 blocks per game. But that's not all. He also led the team to a 30-2 record and a state championship. The NBA stars shot 66.1% from the floor and 82.2% from the free throw line. His 2013-2014 season was actually supposed to be during his junior year at St. Joseph's, but in 2012, he stated that he was reclassifying as a junior instead of a sophomore so he could graduate a year early. His fusion of size and skills got him to the top of most national recruiting ranking. He's part of the Dominican national team. As we mentioned before, Towns' mother is from the Dominican Republic, making him fit to play for the country's national team. That was something Carl had been doing since he was a 16-year-old when Kentucky coach John Calipari was coaching the team. Carl played for the Dominican Republic team in the 2011 FIBA Americans Championship and in the 2012 Olympic Qualifying Tournament, in which the Dominicans came up just short of qualifying for the Olympics in London. If you like this video, then you'll surely enjoy one of the sport's biggest prospects, Mikey Williams' lifestyle. Now, do you think Carl Anthony Towns deserves to end up in the Hall of Fame? Drop your thoughts in the comment section below. Be sure to subscribe and thanks for watching.